Hi, my beloved Leo. Welcome to your prophetic love reading. Thank you so much for joining me, Leo. Leo, if you are keen or interested in booking me for a reading or a one-on-one -on -one session, you will find my email listed on the screen or down in the description box below. I do offer any and all kinds of readings as well. Okay, let us begin with your prophetic um, love reading. This is Spirit's poem for you, Spirit's word for you, okay? With regards to your love life, Leo. Listen. Lay me on these sheets the way you rest your hand on the blank pages of your journey. Allow your thoughts to pour all over me. I want to be every letter of your poetry. Okay, I'm going to read that again. Lay me on these sheets the way you rest your hand on the blank pages of your journal, okay? Journal. Allow your thoughts to pour all over me. I want to be every letter of your poetry. Okay, Leo. That was spirit's word for you, okay? Let's begin with your prophetic love reading. So, you're dealing... Okay, sorry, Leo. There is someone you are dealing with here that possesses a very, very high vibrational energy, okay? This person has walked a tough path in their life and they've encountered very spiritual things too okay this is someone who does not fear anything um when it comes to things of evil things of unorthodox okay this is someone who is tapped in and understands what they're tapped into this is someone who knows themselves and knows how they think okay and knows their reality okay so this person this very self-assertive person knows one thing for sure they know that they want you to be the one okay they want you to be the one to have their heart okay so when you're dealing with someone like this leo you need to understand how they think so that you understand how they view you and what this means to them this person is not an average person they don't date to just date okay they hold motive in everything that they do they have heavy intention and purpose in every step they take so when they invest themselves they invest themselves in something that they truly desire okay they truly want this for themselves okay leo this person is really sure that they want you to be the one to have their heart they value themselves, they respect themselves, okay? They want you to be the one to, to have them because they know that you uphold yourself to the same standard. This is someone that might not vocalize these thoughts, okay? They might be someone that keeps to themselves very reserved individual most of the time. However, they are human after all. They have thoughts, they have true emotions and feelings it's just that they don't express okay they just quiet they just like that but they do feel and they feel for you deeply okay i feel like you need to understand you need to understand this person for the individual that they are as they understand you for the individual that you are because you have your own way of doing things and so do they your thought process is not going to be the same as, as theirs. Therefore, how you feel about things is not going to be the same too. How things affect you and how you react to them is going to differ all times because you are individuals, Leo, before you are one. It's like there's a need of letting this person, there's, it's like there's a need of letting each other just be individuals first, okay? Because I'm getting, this person might feel like, they're a bit held back um, with fully being because they feel like um, there's a lot of expectations placed on them. And already this person's life is very busy or very, 
it's like a lot of people have expectations on them okay um things that they need to uphold maybe a, a particular image okay if this person is a masculine then being a masculine in this day and age you need to understand leo like it's very difficult like it's very very difficult and this person's only just human experiencing this they don't want to be masculine outside and have to be masculine inside too okay like they want to be vulnerable with you they want to lower their guard they don't want to feel like a masculine in your presence because they're already experiencing a lot of that in their reality they need your ear okay they need your touch and they also really need your understanding of their own individual life and individual experiences as a human being okay we're all different and if this is a feminine then you need to understand leo that feminines need to feel like they can be vulnerable with you before they can fully open up they need to feel safe emotionally okay they, they need to feel like you can handle them okay and if you don't present yourself within that likeness and you are always fumbling on yourself okay my beloved leo masculine this feminine will perceive you within that regard and will be cautious in what part of themselves they show to you because they don't know what you can handle because they see that you can hardly handle yourself okay and that's the truth okay leo moving on you guys so it's like this person is the person you're dealing with is a very deep thinker there's someone who who they're, they're an individual the type of individual that goes through everything they dissect everything they, they 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 look at every bit and piece of something so that they understand it so that they process it so that they they know they roll in it they don't want to they don't like living a life of non-clarity okay they don't like living a life that is just it's not there's no direction it's senseless they they, they like structure this is someone that likes structure okay so whenever they feel like they can't be comfortable with someone that is a very it's not a solid structure so they don't feel like they can build upon that okay so this shaky behavior that you might be showing this person is pushing them away emotionally okay they might be there in the physical but emotionally they you were pushing them away okay their heart space is there it's hurting because it's like they don't it's like they feel like they don't deserve this okay and when someone feels like this is something they don't deserve they pull themselves back bit by bit by bit okay they pull themselves back that's why it's very important to have open communication with one another so that you both know how you both feel about things and you know what needs to be worked on by both of you so that everything is in the equilibrium everything has tranquility there's peace because you both are putting equal amounts of effort into this no one is going above and beyond and surpassing the other's efforts it's like you should look at yourself as teammates Look at yourself as a partner. Look at yourself as, you know, soulmates, mates. Don't go against your mate, okay? If there's a problem, you speak about it and you, like you would with a, with a friend. Ever thought of how difficult it is to resolve an issue with a partner, but it's so easy to do so with a friend? It's like those type of conversations, you can have them with a friend. You can really put them in their place and tell them how you really feel like, no, this is affecting me. I don't like what you did. But it's very difficult when you're doing it with this person because of the emotions that are evoked in the two of you. Okay, it's very deep. It's not as a friend, you know, would feel. Okay, it's not. It's not the same, and that is completely okay. But what is not okay is allowing the both of you guys to go through hardships caused by the both of you, inflicted by the both of you towards one another when you don't want that for yourselves like you you love one another right so why are you inflicting each other with pain why are you against one another you know the love should conquer at the end like the love should be the reason you want to lower your pride leo okay if it's really as real as you claim it is because that 
is what love is that is what having a partner means it's like you you must treat them the way you treat yourself like be as sensitive be as thoughtful be as caring because this is someone you are one with at the end of this or you want to be one with okay so don't treat them as someone you are you are opposed to because then that 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 is really really hurtful to the other person imagine loving someone and giving you all and then it's like it's not enough or you feel like what am i doing wrong like am i not? it's like it's really difficult it's hurtful you know so give them that peace of mind and ease their pain and anything any trauma that might be linked to it with your understanding and your and your if he's a feminine and give him give him that give him give her that um if she's a, a feminine give her that that masculine that healthy masculine side of you Leo okay that side of you that listens and is okay with being pushed around a little bit and played with a little bit the side of you that doesn't get defensive and insecure with the smallest things the side of you that is well aware that this person it's like they would die for you okay that's the side of love that's love and if my beloved leo if this is a masculine they need that feminine they need they need that 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 soft touch like some of you might have a very ma- might have a ma- my feminines you might m- might live a very masculine life maybe your work requires you to be masculine or maybe you've dealt with a lot you've been through a lot and you're very masculine by nature okay there's a lot of things linked to your trauma that are um, uh, uh, enabling you to just be very masculine maybe in your way of speaking thinking in your way of being but you need to understand that with the masculine you can't be another masculine that like put a put a man and a man in the same place like that and they don't know each other like they're going to clash you know it's like there's a possibility that they just won't get along you know or they just there's going to be an energy of feeling like i want to be alpha you know but that's not a relation that's not i mean mm-mm. this masculine requires a different side of you they want you to actually listen when they speak take it all in as they take it all in when you speak and you require this of them too they too need the same okay leo you need to reevaluate yourself my love and see what you can do within your behalf to accommodate them because they are two human experiencing this and they have needs too as you do okay that was your prophetic love reading leo i really hope this helped you my beloved if you're keen or interested in booking me for a reading I offer any and all kinds i also offer one on one sessions with me via facetime skype as well as video call okay you find my email listed on the screen or down in the description box below I'm sending you nothing but love. Until next time, Leo. Bye.